So she came to us really because um, this farm worker said, you know, she, she needed help walking again. So we got straight on to trying to get her physio and, and uh, some dog wheels, which has really made a, a big difference to her life. After that, Rosie just started flying on these wheels. And um, so now she's getting bigger and outgrowing them. We're, we're, we're looking at getting bigger wheels for her now. So we've now got um, a vet physio coming um, later this week, actually. Um, she usually does horses, so it's going to be a first for her working with a, a sheep. We're really excited and hope that, you know, these wheels are only going to be temporary. Um, that's the plan anyway, because the vet's monitoring her quality of life. And at the moment, she's really happy and she's enjoying life. She's enjoying the wheels. She loves her food. Uh, she loves all the attention. Um, so we're hoping that the physio might get a walk in again and we won't need these wheels. And then what happens? Does she just become part of the Frank's family? Yes, definitely. <laughs> She'll be part of the group. There's sheep and goats here that all live out their lives happily. Um, and yeah, she'll be part of the, the flock, so to speak.